Hey guys, welcome to another episode in the deep playthrough of HC Unity. Um, we are in memory 9.1. We have to kill a lady, Levesque. I'm not even sure what her name is. Marie Levesque. Um, in, she's holding a gala inside. We have to infiltrate it. Um, I am now in a slightly different spot than where we left off uh, in the previous episode in the ending I was in the whole way up there but then when I reloaded the checkpoint because I uh, got spotted over there um, this whole area here it, um, it, it, it saved the checkpoint after I uh, freed the prisoners uh, and it remembered that state and that means all these bodies are just like uh, around so uh, all the enemies in front of here are actually uh, gone now including any enemies that were inside over there so my entrance via the ground floor which I preferred uh, as opposed to the top floor it's all free now so instead of going back to where I was and continuing uh, on the top floor I will now enter the building through the uh, ground floor uh, also because the challenges in this episode are one don't get any uh, uh, bells uh, bell alarms like the bells over there the alarm bells uh, and that's where I failed in the ending of the previous episode there was a guy up on there who um, sounded the alarm ah, there's a way in over there as well by the way uh, but the other challenge is, we have to, it's a bit cryptic, we have to save a Thomas Levesque, which I think is either the brother or the husband of the Marie Levesque that we have to kill. But I am not sure, um, oh, there's a guy indeed walking about, just like there was a guy walking about over there, looking inside over the courtyard uh, uh, sometimes. Anywho, what I wanted to say is that um, I'm not sure whether where that Thomas Levas guy that we have to save for as a challenge, where he is. So it could well be that he is in the ground floor, and that means, which is the most obvious reason to infiltrate the building. At most players will probably use that. I'm not sure, but that's an assumption. So when I go in uh, through the top floor. I may totally miss uh, the, any Thomas Levesque encounters and then miss out on that um, on that challenge. So that is another reason why I would like to go in through the ground floor. So let's do that now. And these bodies, they actually contain loot. So, never let a good loot go to waste. Because initially there were still, uh, after I freed the prisoners, in the gameplay session itself, there were still guys uh, over there inside. But now after the reload, yeah, the game goes to the state after the prisoners have been freed and those prisoners indeed usually they get into immediately a big scuffle with all the guards in the courtyard but I already took these those guards out so the prisoners they were just uh, hunching up in the middle not doing anything there was nothing to uh, skirmish but now after this checkpoint yeah, the game is in that state that the prisoners did get into a big fight and took out all the guys including the guys that were inside over here like this guy he was standing over there looking at the doorway so that was really blocking a bit my way in so it's, oh shit oh shit Ooh, that was a close call but this could only be a good thing i would say Like so. <laughs> Alright. 
right, where to go? No idea. Probably upstairs. But let's just check it out a bit with that Talnos Levesque guy, for instance. Right, we have a garden. Stairs up, stairs, stairs up. Uh, that will probably be the same on the other side. Yeah, but on this side I already took out the guy. Uh, there's another guy over there. See if we can take him out, why not? Yeah, I wonder whether it's at all necessary to be honest. Yeah, let's just take him out. I, I saw a door, I'm not sure what that door was about. Oh shit, is she going all the way over here? <coughs> I was not expecting him to go all the right. way over here. Back to the shop. Just another way in. Uh, one second. All right, let's quickly see what we need to do. Yeah, we need to get up now yeah, to the first floor, I guess. So I think I will just leave these. Um, I'm not gonna take out all the guys, there's just not really any use to it. Maybe I will check over here, I'm just curious. Yeah, we can get the, the main stairs or side stairs. Uh, let's just take a side stairs. Pretty sure there will be guys walking about here as well. And then the question is uh, I wanted to say which floor did we need to go? The top floor or this one? But apparently this one. Yeah, two guys. They're pretty separated, which is a good thing, I would say. Now they're waiting for each other, goddammit. Much. 
Ah, there's an alarm bell over here. I have to disable that for sure. First, let's see where the dudes are. Only one is coming now. I'm not sure where the other one is. I do like it. It are pretty random patrols, it seems. Dream that. Man, bad frame rate over here. Suddenly. I'm about it. All right, please don't let the other dudes come by now. Nope, don't see anybody. Hey, all right, I'm playing a little bit, uh, I'm playing it cautious. Because it's very easy to fill. And I just prefer not to. All right, there the other dude is. He is going. Yeah, over here. Take him out. Something's going on. Hold on. What's this? Very nice. Jeez, hear these people scream. Alright, um, we need to get over there. Holy shit, there's another one over there. Holy shit, and one over here as well. There's one over there. I don't see. The guy to the left seems to be stationary. Ah, the other guy is walking back. Let's get the stationary guy out of the way. All right, and let's take the other guy out of the way too. That's walking over here. Although he's walking all the way over there. It's maybe a bit much. And now he's stopping. And here he comes back. So let's take him out. Patience is a virtue, let's just say it like that. Like so. Appelez la garde! Il y a des détrousseurs ici! La garde, détrousseurs! Alright. Uh, Oh. I would like to thank you all for coming. Tonight we celebrate another milestone on the road to liberty. 
Who is taking this speech? Ah, there she is. Right, but apparently we also need to take out Thomas Leverk, Levesque. Could have sworn I was just behind him. Is that a new suit? Very fetching. Right, she's just walking circles. Everyone all right here? More wine, anyone? I can just take her out, but the thing is, I want that challenge. We have to rescue Thomas Levesque. So glad to see you. I do hope you're not thinking of leaving. The evening's only just beginning. All right, did they sound the alarm bell? Guards, oh. assassin. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they will. Yeah, I'm not going to take this risk, actually. I am going to restart. Uh, sorry for that. I will quickly try to get back here. I will do it a bit quicker. She did say something about a cellar, a wine cellar or something. So. I'm going to check out what's uh, in the basement. Maybe can do that uh, immediately. But yeah, let's hope there was a safe game when uh, we infiltrated over there. Like a checkpoint. I doubt it. I think we will just start in the core charge again, but you never know. God damn it, I'm in the core charge again. All right, I will do it quickly, get uh, back over there. Oh my God, so annoying. Also won't be um, looting all these bodies. Let's just leave it. We'll not take them all out. And then we are almost back where we started. So there are only a couple of guys walking around here. I want to take out. I wonder where that fat guy is. There was like a big guy walking over here. Somewhere. Uh, they are all gone. Maybe the game remembered me taking them out already. That would be very nice. Oh shit. So there's a big guy to the left, but that, that can be because on the left side I didn't take out any guys yet. Would 
be very nice if the guys I took out on the right side, if that all was saved. We have two big dudes. Let's just take them out and I can also explore the place a bit as regards to the um, the cellar that she was talking about. to take him out uh, with a choke, obviously, but I screwed it up. I don't think the others were alerted, so, because he was this isolated, so to say. Um, yeah, let's take out the other two as well. The big one will walk to the right, I think. Eventually. Like so. Ah, shit. I did see a guy walking uh, to the right down below. So. It's not like they're all gone. I wonder, by the way, about which guy I was spotted uh, in that upstairs party <coughs> earlier when I restarted. Because I did use, normally I don't use Eagle Vision, but I did use it to uh, highlight the actual target. And I only saw like two guards near her. I didn't see any third person. Apparently I overlooked it because another person got me spotted, a regular dude. Not one of those spear guys that were walking with the target. here so amazing um, all right let's just take out the guys to the right as well while we're at it by the way did I saw an alarm bell over there no it was a statue or a flower pot it because ah there he comes I think earlier there were more people here now there seems to be only one dude which is fine by me still looking for a seller Oh, there really was 
nothing here. Uh, that door also I cannot interact with. Yeah, so I really don't see a seller. I think that lady, the one we need to take out, was referring. Holy shit. That was a close call. I don't see a cellar. Maybe the entrance is somewhere else outside. All right, let's just mix it up and no, I will. Uh, I wanted to say let's uh, go in through the left, but let's just continue where we left off because maybe if the game indeed remembered that I took out some guys, uh, that it saved in the meantime. Then this should be more cleared up already. Ah, uh, no, there's still a guy over there. And the question is... Yeah, there's also still a guy over there. Holy shit. This was not the most smartest thing to do, I think. Could have better taken them out in this little side area, but... Because now they will investigate him over there. And yeah, also with their sights towards me, so I cannot ambush them now. So this is just a bit stupid. A uh, little bit uh, stupid. Who's killed him? Who saw what happened? Right, the other guy. Less of a worry. Oh shit, there's another guy. All right, it does take some time, this stealth, but yeah, it is what it is. I do like it. And now I cannot take out this guy because the other guy is walking past. Is she also going to the left? You're kidding me. Oh, he's walking straight ahead. All right, I will pick out where is the other dude oh there holy shit please don't turn around uh, please don't get spotted right we are going to take that that stationary guy assuming the other guy is on his patrol so now you have to spray now only two left and we were back where we were at the start or, or at the previous fail point yeah. <laughs> right if that other guy is not coming up quickly i will just take out this guy first Man, the frame rate is atrocious over here. Yeah, there's the other guy coming. We should be around the corner. But the other guy actually probably notices his body. I think he will notice his body to the right. Yes, there he goes. It doesn't matter. Hang on. 
Alright, now the question is, which guy spotted me earlier? There was a guy, alright, I see a spear guy over there. It just trigger first that correspondence, or that dialogue. Yeah, but there is no other... Ah, there are three guys. Sorry, I thought it were two with her. That third guy, which is walking to the right, is the guy that spotted me. Somehow I got spotted again. I have no idea by whom. Alright, um, I will uh, end the episode here. In the uh, in between episodes I will play towards over here and then we will continue. Uh, I keep yeah, getting spotted here. It's a bit annoying. Um, hope you enjoyed. I hope to see you in the next one. For the meantime, do not forget. Always do. Keep on gaming. See you later.